Hi guys, greetings of the day. Myself Raghavendra. Today we are going with a lamina problem. A circular lamina inclined to the VP appears in the front view as an ellipse of major axis 30 mm and minor axis 15 mm. The, ma the major axis is parallel to both HP and VP. One end of the minor axis is in both the HP and VP. Draw the projections of the lamina and determine the inclination of the lamina with the VP. So it is a circular lamina inclined to the VP appears in the front view as an ellipse of major axis 30 mm and minor axis 15 mm. Major axis is parallel to both HP and VP. Similarly, one end of the minor axis is in both HP and VP. So directly he has not mentioned where it is resting. Instead of that one, he has mentioned that front view is an ellipse. So it is resting in VP only. Then only we can get in the front view as an ellipse. Draw horizontal line. Name it as XY. VP. HP. Now construct a circular lamina above the exponent. It is resting on VP only. The dimension for the lamina is 30 mm diameter because major axis will not change. Only the minor axis will change in the second position. So major axis, whatever it is there, the same thing it will be there. That is 30 mm he has given. So 30 mm is the diameter. So 15 mm is radius. Construct a circular lamina. So dimension for this circle is 30 mm diameter or 15 mm radius. Now, if we divide this one by eight equal parts, that much it is not required because for the last position, the major axis is parallel to both VP and HP. Just rotate and place. So because of that, one, I'll go with only four divisions. Horizontal vertical extend those two this is diameter 30 d dash d dash c dash d dash now project the points in downward direction. Join these endpoints. A, D is visible, whereas B is invisible. D in the bracket of B. And this one is This completes the first position. For the second position, he has given front view looks like an ellipse of major axis 30 mm, whereas minor axis 15 mm. So if you project this one, this 30 will be there. So horizontally project this one. So if you join this one, this will be 30 mm only. This is major axis, whereas minor axis is 15 mm. Means from the midpoint, half of 15 is 7.5, 7.5 mm towards right side, and left side also same thing, 7.5 mm.
join these endpoints with 300 curl. So this is A dash, B dash, C dash, D dash. Now project the points in downward direction from A dash till X value, it has from C dash draw in downward direction so now take this ac as a radius that is 30 mm because the circle is for 30 mm ac as a radius this endpoint as center 30 mm as the radius cut an arc on this line join this one with line This is A, this one is C, midpoint is a D in the bracket B. He also has to find out the inclination of the lamina with the VP, that is 5. That is 60 degree. Now, this completes the second position. For the third position, he has given that major axis is parallel to both HP and VP. So, here major axis is B dash, D dash, it has to be parallel to both VP and HP, nothing but it has to be parallel to X, Y, Y. Along with that one, one end of the minor axis is in both HP and VP. So one end means already A, it is on X, Y, Y, means here also A dash should be on X, Y, Y. For that one, this is 30 mm only, B dash, D dash is 30 mm only, whereas A dash, D dash, It is 15 mm because it is a minor axis. So first draw 15 mm line. Afterwards from midpoint, because this one is passing through the midpoint, the length is 30 mm means half of that one right side, half of that one left side. So from the midpoint, 15 mm right side, 15 mm left side. This is A dash, C dash, B dash, D dash. Join these four points with the free handed curve. Now project the points. So A and A dash are on the same, uh, on X, Y line only. There's A dash, C dash on the same line. From this one, C will come on this line till this one. Whereas B and D will come on this line. Project till that point. From B dash and D dash.
play this one is saying b or this one is d so join all the four endpoints with free handed curve We have to write this answer also that is phi is equal to 60 degree. Phi equals to 60 degree. So this completes the problem. Thank you. Please subscribe my channel.